Hey guys, today we're talking about six ways to make an outfit more interesting. What's up guys, welcome back to Gen Slange. I'm George, this is Blake. If you have not hit that subscribe button yet, hit that right now. We are here every week talking about men's fashion, lifestyle, and everything in between. And today we are talking about six accessories that will make any outfit more interesting. So if you have kind of a basic wardrobe with only a few pieces in them, you can kind of make outfits look a little new or change things up with different accessories. And today we're gonna to talk about six that will make any outfit just a little more interesting. And the first and easiest way to make your outfit pop, guys, is a bag. So whether you're a backpack or a tote guy, a bag's instantly gonna take your outfit to the next level. Right, guys, and a backpack is gonna be more the casual vibe t-shirts. If you're wearing a suit, you don't really wanna have the straps of a backpack on, but when you pick a bag, you really want something that's kind of clean, sleek, but still stylish. So we have this bag actually from today's video sponsor, The Fifth. This bag was awesome because it's all black, has nice silver hardware that looks substantial, and it, it has just a classy vibe to it, you know, and it's gonna take any outfit up a notch. I've seen a ton of high-end backpacks that have this shape and look to them, but this does not have the high-end price tag, so you're getting a super good deal on this, and it won't break the bank. Now, for you guys who don't wear or don't use backpacks like myself, or not often, we have this nice little carry-all, I guess you call it a, la a laptop bag. It's a cool, it's simple, it's understated, yet it'll go with any of your suits, especially a blue suit, navy suit, dark suit, and it's gonna be one of those bags that doesn't draw a lot of attention, but people are gonna always ask you about it. And moving on to number two, guys, sunglasses. Right, guys, if you wanna accessorize your outfit and make it pop and have one piece that can go with pretty much everything, a classic pair of sunglasses is going to be the way to go. So whether you go with the classic Wayfair type shape or a cl Clubmaster-esque type shape with the metal rim on the bottom and the plastic up top, it's gonna be classic, it's gonna go casually and dressed up. If you get into more funky shapes, you might have to pick either dressy or casual, yes. but these two styles will go with anything. Yeah, so I think these two are a way to keep your outfit still looking sharp and crisp, and it's gonna make it elevated, you know, so you're gonna have that pop, but you're not gonna be someone who's just asking for attention, you know? You just wanna have a nice pair of sunglasses, maybe add a little gold or a little bit of copper framing them, and you're set. All right, guys, and the third accessory that will take your outfit to a new level, watches. Now, the fifth sent over four watches for us to try out. They wanted us to do this video, so we are using their watches in the video. As you can see, I have on their diver, and then we have this classic gold mesh band, which will work well with the suit here. Blake's wearing a classic brown leather with a black face. That's gonna go super well casually, jeans and a button down as he's wearing it. And you know, a watch is just going to make that statement that when you're you know, sitting at a desk or meeting a person for the first time, it's gonna be something that will catch their eye. And the thing about a watch is you can wear it all the time and you can kind of make it your, your signature. So you don't really need a ton of watches. You can have you know, maybe a dress watch and a casual watch or one that bridges the gap and just have one watch, but no one's gonna judge you for wearing a watch, the same watch constantly. No, not at all. And number four on the list, guys, we have jewelry. Whether you're a bracelet, necklace, or ring guy, jewelry is something that could take an outfit up a notch. Right, guys. Me and Blake have done a video on this before. We talked about all our different jewelry that we wear. So I'll have a link to that down below. You can check that out. But basically, you know, if you're wearing a ring or a bracelet or a necklace that has some sort of meaning to you, it's just gonna be that little extra conversation piece that when you meet someone new, someone can ask about it if they see it. So, you know, I have this ring right here. It was given to me by my dad. It has mine and my dad's initials on it and a little diamond. And you know, I get I get questions about a pinky ring a lot because people are like, oh, you're wearing a pinky ring. And then I'm like, oh, it's my dad. And they're like, oh, that's cool, that's cool. Well, so, technically it has your dad's initials on it. Right. So you just, you got the same We have the name. same initials, <laughs> so yes. Also jewelry is a way that you could actually um, style your watch with your jewelry. I do that a lot. So if I'm wearing like a brown leather watch, I'll try to wear like brown accents. Or if I'm wearing like a gold watch, I'll try to wear like a gold bracelet. Right. I, just, I like that, I like well, to have that Yeah, nice I mean, if you only have one watch, you can kind of make it look a little different with one or two different bracelets every now and then. That's right, and if you have a killer piece of jewelry, people are gonna focus on that, and you can wear the same thing over and over, and the jewelry piece is gonna be the one that's talked about. All right, guys, up next on the list, hats. Now, Blake and I, I'm not really a hat guy. I have one hat that I wear all the time. It's that Stetson hat I will show you right now. But Blake is more they've of a hat guy it. than they've I am. They've all seen your hat. Yeah. Okay, guys. Hats you know the hat. Is, 
So hats is an easy way to make a simple outfit pop. Whether you have a wide brim or a fedora or a baseball cap, just make sure it's a really cool one and not a New York hat. Um, <laughs> you, you can have an outfit elevated just like that. So in the summertime, I like to wear a lot of denim and t-shirts and it's really plain Jane. Right. A hat by itself is just gonna make it like look, you know, it's, it's gonna make it have some substance. It doesn't look like everybody else. I would also try to opt for like a color, so like a green, a blue, a gray. Yeah, a little little interesting. If you yeah. if you can get a hat that has like a cool band or maybe even like accessorize a feather in there if you're that type of guy, it is definitely gonna make a statement and that is all you need to make a basic outfit pop. But so like Blake said, t-shirt and jeans is super easy. Anybody can wear that, but to make that look interesting is really difficult. All right guys, and last but not least, for you suited guys out there, you know the accessories that make an outfit pop, and that's the pocket squares, the tie bars, the lapel pins, the ties, just the little accents, the suspenders if you wanna be that guy. You know, those little accents are what makes a suit interesting, especially if you have a navy suit with a white shirt. The only thing you can do to make that interesting is accessorize. So with suiting guys, you don't need to have a ton of suits, okay? Even if you have one, that is, that is perfectly fine. Um, my teller at, at my local bank, he has, he wears the same dark suit. I think it's like a blackish, like maybe a navy blue. But he always changes his accessories from his tie to his tie bar to his pocket square. And he has different folds. So the outfit always looks like very well put together, yet very different. All right guys, so that pretty much wraps up the video. I hope this was interesting for you. I hope you learned something. Um, once again, thank you to the fifth watches for sending over the watches and the bags we featured in this video. It is sponsors like these that help this channel keep going and let us produce the content that we produce. So if you can, click the link down below, check out the fifth watches, take a look at this bag. It is, it might be my new favorite backpack, honestly. And once again, if you have not hit that subscribe button yet, hit that right now and give us a follow over on Instagram at Jen's Lounge. Cheers, Cheers guys.